The big M.O. for the Stephen F. Austin team as this pitch is hit on the ground, slowly knocked down by Curry. He gets up quickly, flips over to first base where Greg Holly covers, and there's one out. I was about to say the key one out here in the top half of the first. Hits the first pitch on the ground towards short. Featherston right there, feels at the waist, and dispatches with Hines. He stands up. And so he was tying himself up, and he's gone back to the way he hit, and he drives this one through the hole on the right side. Base hit. Carruthers rounding third, heading home. The throw is cut off. Carruthers scores. one nothing on Frogs. To third goes Ellington. That's the warning track. 2-0 pitch. Bouncer, left side of the infield, off the glove of Ferguson. It kicks out in the left field, and Carpenter is going to hustle towards third. He'll make it, and Ellington, recognizing the fact that nobody was covering second, trots out there, traps to second with a double. Carpenter aboard over at third. Line drive the opposite way, base hit. Carpenter scores easily from third. Ellington will hold it third. It's 2-1, to one, Horn Frogs. Good piece of hitting by Matt Curry. 61 for the season, a chance to add to the Horn Frog lead. Drives this one towards left field. Justin Long right there, reaches up, makes the catch. Tagging from third is Ellington. He trots home, and it's three to one, Horn Frogs. Sacrifice fly, and a run batted in. 2-2, two -two. swing and a miss. And after falling behind 2-0, Garish comes back with three straight strikes to get long swinging for the first out. From last year. One, two delivery, grounded to short. Featherston takes a couple steps in, guns to first for the second out. No chance tonight, he hasn't quite been able to convert. There goes Vern, the pitch swung on line into left center field, the base hit. Vern rounding second. This one's going to go all the way to the wall. They're going to send him home. He'll get in easily. Now Holiday's going to head for third, but the stop sign put up, and he'll dive back into second base. The RBI double by Brian Holiday, and it's 4-1 to one TCU. 3-2 pitch. There goes the runner. The ball is hit in the air to straightaway center field. Rivera going back. Has a beat on it, reaches up, makes the catch just shy of the warning track for the final out of the inning. So Meyer gave it a ride. Oh, and one a 5 yard. Hit back through the middle. This one's going to squirt through for a base hit. Carpenter being waved home by Randy Mazie. The throw is cut off, and the Frogs now lead at 5-1. to one. RBI base hit for Taylor Featherston. Woodruff hitting 211, first at bat today. Swings and hits this one high in the air to deep right center field. Kaufman going back, still going back. Can't make the play as it hits the top of the wall. Woodruff digging hard is going to try for third. The throw is cut off and Woody's safe at third with a triple. In the air, a little flare towards right center field. It's going to drop for a base hit. Givens with a late start will score easily from third. And it's now a 6-3, horn, a 6-2 Horn Frog lead. The 2-1 pitch. Carpenter hits it high in the air. Left field towards the line. Justin Long comes on and overruns it. One run will score. As coming home is Rivera from third base to make it a 7-2 ball game. A defensive lapse. Ellington hits this one high in the air to right center field. Kaufman back at the wall. It's off the scoreboard, a home run. A three-run opposite field homer for Chris Ellington. And the Horn Frogs have broken this game wide open. They now lead it 10-2. Frogs win in the ninth for Stephen F. Austin. No runs, no hits. They leave a man stranded. A final score in this one, the Horn Frogs defeat Stephen F. Austin 10-2. We'll take a timeout, come back with.